Hello everyone, I am Sarathi, Assistant Professor, Department of English, KSA College of Arts and Science for Women. Today we are going to learn about Linguistics and Phonetics Unit 5, Speech Mechanism. Speech Mechanism is overlaid function. There are no organs whose primary function is to produce speech. Articulators, parts of speech mechanism that serve to produce a different configuration which makes a different sound. So this, this, the, the, this that is a picture in uh, here. Organs of speech, uh, we have a nasal cavity, um, alveolar ridge, lips, teeth, a palate, ovula, tongue, larynx, phonics, vocal cords, epiglottis. So these are the organs of speech. While speaking, our uh, words are pronouncing our, some words. We are using these type of uh, things. So uh, next we are going to see about a classification of sounds. There are many classifications in sounds. The simple vowels are A, E, I, O, U. We already know about these things. Uh, so some, something called diphthongs. Uh, a, E, A, E, A, A, A. And in early Latin, A, O, O. These sounds are uh, diphthongs. In the diphthongs, both vowel sounds are heard. One following the other in the same syllable. So consonants are either voiced sonnets or voiceless sad. Voiced consonants are pronoun pronounced with the same vocal murmur that is heard in vowels. Voiceless consonants lack in this murmur. Uh, the voice consonants are uh, B, D, G, L, R, M, N, Z, consonantal I and V. Voiceless consonants are P, T, C, K, K, F, Sh, S, and X. These sounds are consonant, voiceless consonants. Um, uh, the, 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 it is a picture for vowels and the consonants. Uh, we can see the sounds like alphabetic order. Thank you.